to start off, our application is going to disable scrolling of the container when the content doesn't extend beyond uh, the actual screen size. However, if we change the content to be something that does extend beyond the total screen size, we can see that the scroll is still enabled, but the content is cut off. To fix this, we'll go back to our container component and we're going to add a prop to our scroll view and that is going to be on content size change. An on content size change is going to be a function. We'll set it up to be this dot on content size change, which we can go ahead and define. And this on content size change function is going to take two arguments. The first one's going to be the content width and the second one is going to be the content height. And with this, we're going to go ahead and say this dot set state and we'll set screen height to be the content height. Now, before we can use this, we'll go ahead and define some initial component state. Inside of here, we'll set the screen height to initially be zero. Now to actually use this information, we're going to go ahead and import dimensions from React Native, and then we can go ahead and pull the height off of dimensions.get window. We can say this dot state dot screen height is greater than height. So when the screen height, when the content size is larger than the actual height of the screen, we'll go ahead and enable scroll. We can now see that we can scroll through the content when it extends beyond the size of the screen. But if we go back and use our smaller piece of content, scrolling is still disabled. 